I'm G. I'm a videographer and photographer from Canada traveling across South America. And this week, I've decided on Guatemala. Come along with me. These past four weeks have gone by so quickly. My intuition was telling me that it's time to move on. So after four months of traveling with friends, I realized I want to travel solo. In fact, I need to. I almost missed my flight because of the lovely Tico traffic, but I kept seeing angel numbers reminding me to just trust and surrender. And she looked at me, I looked at her, and she talked talk to her friend in Theo de Dios. And I was telling her, like, yoga. But then, like, way after he, like, there's no freaking way. So I kept banging the door, like, boom, 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 like, hello, hola, hola. Hi, Baba. Good morning, little guy. <laughs> Sharp. Bro. That was such an, a clean cut. Like, that cat had a knife in its paws, I swear. I'm quite familiar with solo travel, and honestly, I haven't had the best experiences until I realized I was actually looking for other people the entire time, not really solo traveling. So I intended on coming here and getting so comfortable with being alone. And then I met M. We have so many similarities between us, so many alignments in life that it's just further proof that there is no such thing as coincidences. I'm still going to be with myself, but it's nice having a friend. There are so many stray animals here, it's wild. This is your little place? No. Oh my god, so cute! Like that. You like that little girl? <laughs> the little dirty girl? <laughs> little dirty girl. Now I mix your pills. <laughs> so sketchy. Um, okay, I'm gonna get rid of it. That, but that did work much better. Pill for it? This pill is um, an antibiotic. She's coming. Traveling has made me realize how much I miss having my own kitchen and how much I love cooking, especially for others. It's probably the Filipina in me, but I can't help but take care of other people. I mean, if I'm putting all this effort into one meal, why not make it for two or three more? Let me cook for you. Mama G's got you. I really truly believe that the energy we create and uh, put into our meals, actually, you can taste it. So let's talk about something that's lovely and sweet. The produce here is a fraction of the cost that it is in Canada. So you bet your bottom dollar that I'm saving all of mine by cooking every single one of my meals. It's a vegetarian kitchen, which is no big deal at all because I've been practically vegetarian all month. So I've been filling up on these healthy fats like avocados and eggs to make sure that I'm full all day. Oh, and I'm gluten free now, so that's a struggle. The only thing that happens to me is that I get an itchy, itchy scalp. But YOLO sometimes, you know? It's worth it, I think. 
Even though this was just day one of being in this beautiful place, I felt it in my bones. San Marcos La Laguna is magic. It's considered one of the more spiritual communities here, which is, I don't know, a weird thing to say, but it's beautiful here. I actually came here for the acro yoga community, but there's ecstatic dances, cacao ceremonies happening all the time here. It's hard not to tap into a sense of community when there's so much going on. Now that all the retreats are over for now, I have two months worth of footage to go through. Two months worth of editing to do. So my main priority here in Guatemala is to work. I'm really thankful that I get to play with the whole balance and structure of work and play so that when I do sit down and work, I actually want to. These are so good. Really? Okay, girl, I need to make you better ones, like real ones. A few years ago, I saw Moe's play in Toronto, and I fell in love with this set so hard that I had to see him again. And of course, he happens to be playing at Eagle's Nest the first day I'm here. Just another reason why I had to come. And now I gotta stay. Action. My intuition was really strong about this place. I felt it the moment my feet touched the ground and the air entered my lungs. But I gotta grind and work first, and after we can play. And don't worry, I'll tell you all about it. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, send me some comments, and subscribe if you want to. Just gives me a little reminder that I'm doing something right here. Otherwise, I hope you're having a great day, week, month, and year so far. Love you. <laughs>